healthcare industry, we have a lot of sort of manual handling of documents and basically these manual processes, right, that have been happening for a very long time. So the simplest thing is AI will help reduce costs through the use of um, text technologies and speech technologies. AI will automate much of what we do today that's manual. AI can learn and help us in making better decisions and diagnosis. And I think what we are also going to start seeing is this kind of uh, deep learning AI applications that operate on huge amounts of data that previously were not feasible. Right now, I think we're already poised in some fields to really implement AI in the workflow. So in radiology, for example, we have a lot of pain points which we feel AI could really help us bring better care to the patients. Those kinds of things, triage, helping us with some simple decisions, really those could help us right now. So probably the first thing, we are going to see the human modalities. Right, so we basically will see these systems that are able to talk using you know, voice, using, using text to communicate with us the way other people communicate to us. There's a tremendous amount of information that's in the record in more recent years, such as all their genomic data. And what we look in the future for is when we really can marry all the information about the patient and all the imaging to know everything about the patient. You want to deliver the care that a person needs as quickly as possible and as precise as possible to their need. That will happen. People who are scared of AI today won't be able to live without it. I do believe that we basically stand on the verge of this new revolution where basically using data and, and the, the enormous capabilities to analyze it will be able to change the lives and hopefully help people control their conditions and prevent them from having these conditions ahead of time. I think if you can show to the care provider that these AI tools can allow them to respond faster to their patients, um, allow them to be more accurate in their predictions um, or diagnoses, thereby providing a better outcome for the patient. I think that will aid traction within the clinical environment. Organizations such as hospitals really need to think about this and how they're going to manage this kind of addition to their operation. When you see the tools you put together, help someone, like, you know, make their lives better, easier, more efficient, they're happy with it, that brings me joy.